Hi, it's Jamin from Fraser Homes Coaching. It's thought of the week time again. Now look, life is made up of a whole bunch of events, conversations and experiences. And I think, I think we assume they come with attached meaning. Uh, but in fact, we're sense-making creatures. And we have to work out what things mean. It's our responsibility to decide what these events, conversations, experiences actually mean. Now coaching is all about getting out of this, men- this victim mentality and realizing we have 100% choice about our lives. And one of the coolest things we get to choose is meaning. It is not chosen for us, we get to choose it. You know, the interesting thing about this choice though, uh, when in doubt around meaning, we often pick a negative meaning about ourselves. For instance, if you were to walk outside right now and a friend of yours brushed past you and didn't say hello, you have to decide what that meant. A hundred things could have happened, but you will decide what that means. And when in doubt, often we resort to feeling like that was somehow something we'd done wrong somehow a reflection on ourselves. And, and if we invest in negative meaning, that forms a limiting belief about ourselves. See, now life is not about the things that happen to us, but about the meaning we attach to the things that happen to us. Anthony Robbins tells this incredible story interviewing twin brothers at age 30. One of them lives in Sydney, successful businessman, married with three kids. Life is grand. His twin brother is alcoholic, depressed, a few kids to different women, unemployed. Life is, is horrible. And Anthony says, you know, you're twin brothers, you grew up in the same home. How is it that you turned out like you did? And they both said exactly the same thing. What do you expect with a father like ours? So two people with the same experiences, yet both attach a very different meaning. So the thought of the week is this. What else could that mean? Take a step back from the events, conversations, experiences in your, in your life and pick a meaning that works for you. Pick a meaning that empowers you and continues to build empowering beliefs in your life. Have a great week. I'll talk to you again later.